For your consideration today is the final scene from the 2018 film Venom. Venom is ultimately a physical manifestation of Eddie Brock's anger. Eddie's angry that no one wants to hear the truth anymore. He's been angry for a long time that he was run out of New York, and now he's angry that he has to play nice and run puff pieces about a man that he considers to be a dangerous criminal. So, of course, Eddie goes rogue reporter and ends up getting himself and his fiance fired from their jobs, which brings an end to his forthcoming nuptials. The truth of the matter is, Eddie's angry with himself, and most of us are angry with ourselves. Sure, we point our fingers at the outside world and try to pin the blame on religion and government and corrupt bureaucrats and the rich 1%, but to see the true face of who we're really mad at, well, all we have to do is look in the mirror. And that anger is eating us alive. The only solution to being free from our anger, to being at peace with our raging inner beast, is to be at one with it. We have to atone with our past and accept that this is the life that we have. And whatever events led us up to this point, all the choices and power in our hands as to how we should proceed. Now, some people will continue to battle with their anger and they'll run to other people and ask them to fix their problems because they're afraid of their own power and of losing what they have and thus they'll never achieve symbiosis. And some people are like Carlton Drake and they're far too eager to embrace their anger and power because they want to point it outward and destroy the world. They don't see the wonder and beauty of the world. They don't see that human beings are the scum and the glory of this planet. All they see is the dumpster fire, and they may as well add fuel and let it burn. And some people, like Eddie Brock, will eventually come to acceptance. They tame the beast, they tell it what's acceptable and what isn't. They become whole and at one. But please remember this is all metaphorical and all happens within you. It's not okay to create mayhem in the streets. It's not okay to mete out vigilante justice. It's not okay to create carnage. However, every now and then, it's totally fine to bite someone's head off. Metaphorically. Want exclusive Heroes and Heroines Journey content? Help us build the University for Wanderers. Only on Patreon. I know, I know, it's, uh, I've been there too, it's not fun.